local advocate groups are concerned. This after they say the governor's office is cutting funding for HIV treatment and prevention. This change set to take effect May 31st. Now today we spoke to Samaritan Ministries at Central Baptist Bearden. They hope to continue offering the same services, but say other larger organizations could feel a bigger impact. If, if the local CBOs around Knoxville that provide the bulk of the prevention services weren't able to provide those services, I might test somebody who tests positive for HIV and then I might be very limited into what I could tell them, you know, here, here are the services that are available to you and you can go to Cherokee or you can go to Choice Health Network or you can go to the McNabb Center and you can get the these supportive services. Well, what if those supportive services go away? New contracts will be in place by June 1st.